Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, so right now we're doing a side-by-side -side comparison on the web browsing between the iPhone 5 and the Galaxy S4. So it's just a little quick snippet to see how uh, the web browsers compare to each other. Um, and we're using Safari and the stock browser for here. Um, I'm not using Chrome just so we can get kind of like out of the box experience on web browsing just to make it more fair um, because both of these will come with each respective browser of course you can use different browser for here and you can use different browser for here but that's what we're just using the stock one they come with um, so let's just kind of scroll up and down with each oops sorry all right now let's just kind of scroll up and down does it stop it So, seems like the iPhone kind of stops a little bit more, whereas this one you can kind of just freely um, scroll a little bit easier, but that can sometimes be a little too sensitive for some people, so that's just the way we have it on here. Now let's try pinch to zoom. So both go with pinch to zoom. Now a double tap. Oops. Oops, did I click on that one? So in terms of double tap, so. I don't know why all these double taps don't work, but you know. guys this is pretty close up oh, see there just had a up on that one so overall I want to say on the double tap iOS is a little bit better on the scrolling I kind of like it a little bit better on the S4 Although the iPhone is very fluid, I just like how you can, um, I don't know if it's just loading more of the page or just like you can't continually scroll very easily. Like you kind of have to move up a little bit at a time. Um, that is a preference though. On pinch to zoom, they're pretty much just right there with each other. Oops, don't want to go there. And then. All right, so, um, yeah, let's try just how an article would look like. Now we're not checking actually the web speed. Uh, simply for the fact that uh, this is on LT right now and this is on Wi-Fi, so it'll be different ranges. Um, and we're getting really low on the battery on the iPhone 5 uh, comparison to uh, the S4, so it's running out of battery a little bit. But um, so just definitely, I mean, in terms of how the page looks. Um, you get a lot more, of course, on the S4. That's just because of its bigger screen. But also the clarity difference. I mean, even all the way zoomed out on both. Um, the clarity on here is really good. And if you zoom in a little bit to be like on par with the iPhone, um, it just easily um, shows a bit better on the S4. You just get a bit more uh, to it. And just very well with that because you get more of the screen and still it's just very sharp in comparison. And that's of course because the pixel density is a lot higher on the S4 uh, when comparing to uh, the iPhone uh, 5. But yeah guys, so um, it zoomed all the way out. Oops. Try to see just the pixel clarity. 
This one, the font is bigger, of course, but just the clarity, I mean, even zoomed out, you can still see it very clear on the S4. Alright guys, so that was the web browsing comparison. Stay tuned, because uh, coming up will be the full comparison shortly. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy.